So here's how to add a countdown timer in Wix. It's very easy to do and you can follow along with me right now. So once you are in the Wix editor for the specific website where you wanna add your countdown timer, what you need to do is hover on over to the left side and if you'll scroll down a little, you're gonna have the add app section, simply click there. From there, we have our Wix app market and probably the best way to find it is just simply searching for it. So if you go to search apps, start typing in countdown, timer, you're gonna see there's gonna be an urgency one. There's a few if you want, like the uh, powerful countdown timer, but this one's gonna be good right here. The urgency countdown timer, countdown to deals and discounts for quick sales, simply click that. From there, all we need to do is simply click on the add to site and it says free plan available. So if you are using a free plan, you can utilize it. There is the ability to upgrade, but let's go with one step at a time, right? So add to site. Okay, and so it says adding urgency countdown timer will allow it to read your email address and read basic site and business info. That's fine for me. If it's not for you, then I don't recommend it. I can't obviously tell you that, but in order to add it, you gotta do agree and add. Let's do that. And just like that, we have a countdown timer. So now what we can do is just kind of like drag it down. Obviously you could put it up at the top if you want, or you could put it in a specific section. Really gonna be up to you. Usually the best spot is going to be at the top. This is still just a demo website. So what I'm gonna do is kind of move some stuff around just so I can show you here website coming soon. I guess that would be a good one. Now, nevertheless, regardless of where you put it, let's just talk about a little about how you can edit it. So when you click on it, what you want to do is go to settings. And this is going to be loading settings. So like it says, uh, you can upgrade if needed for more advanced features, but you can utilize it just for the basic stuff. So if you do want the advanced, you have the countdown timer per visitor, um, you have the countdown number per visitor, you have count up number per visitor, and so on and so forth. So, but if you want to do countdown to date, we can utilize this one. This is what it's at. So we have content from this specific date and we want to go to, we can always change this, you know, depending on where you want to go to, uh, we can go to say January 6th, why not my birthday? If you wanna celebrate with me, you know, feel free to. Marketing island birthday, no one cares. This is just something random I'm putting in there, okay? We have a subtitle in case you wanna utilize that. Uh, centered, you know, probably is gonna look best. We have the uh, counter labels. So these are also gonna be, what's it called? Um, the advanced if you wanna upgrade. So we have days, hour, minutes, and seconds. That looks good. Uh, button, let's click there. So if you want none or a link to a web page, so that's also gonna be something you're gonna to wanna to upgrade for. And behavior after count. Once again, so you display the counter, you display a message, you hide the counter, or you repeat the counter, depending on what you want to do there. So let's go back up this way. We have our design, so we can move this over a little so you can see, probably a little bit better, right? So we have no borders. Nope, oh, it was still loading. There we go, no borders. We have square. I think square looks the best in my opinion and we have circle. I'm just gonna keep it on that. So there's gonna be a few more things. We have layout, animation, fonts, size, background, and border, and of course, advanced. Then there's gonna be some pro tips and other apps, You know, not a whole lot going on there. This is gonna be the main stuff right here, obviously. So what I'm gonna do is just like click out of this. I'm just gonna save it. Okay, I'm just gonna do the preview just so you can see what it looks like outside of the Wix editor. All right, and if we scroll down ever so slightly, like I said, just a random spot right there. So Marketing Island's birthday, we've got 312 days, 14 hours, 22 minutes, and 44 seconds and counting. So pretty cool if you ask me, it's free. Like I said, if you wanted to get the better aspects of it, it's going to be a little bit of an upgrade, but uh, that's how you can add a countdown timer to Wix on your website. I hope you got some value out of this in terms of being able to find it, utilize it, and edit it to your liking. If you have any other questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.